Hey guys and welcome to TBMS. In today's video I will be giving you guys a quick demo of how our system works. So this would be the main outlook of our system which appears on your screen. Here you have the menu bar on the top which has different buttons like setup office from where you can maintain all the records of your resources and your patients, hospitals and everything else and then you have reports from where you can create invoices and any other reports and also you have many other options like messages, tools where you have different settings for the system, to-do list, rotors and many other things. Below this you have about three bookings from which you can select which kind of booking you want to make for your patient and then just simply click on it like if you want to make a standard booking we'll click on this STD booking and it would open a separate dialog box where you can simply enter all the details of your bookings and then save but I will be explaining this in a separate video in detail to you guys then next to this it shows how many live jobs you have appearing into your listing below which says at the moment you have 10 bookings which are live below this you have about seven boxes which are showing different states you can say what kind of state you want against each number from the configuration area then you have some buttons which are used to filter jobs like you can filter by today's bookings or today's live bookings or completed bookings you can also refresh or search a booking by its reference number or address or section or even the patient's name and then you can also apply a filter and filter jobs by selecting their statuses like discharged or informal patients and then you can also filter by the hospital selection the subdivision the patient names and resources and then you can also select the pay type as to how the customer is paying and lastly you also can filter live jobs or deleted or completed jobs then you have some bookings below which are separated by different column names like you have the reference numbers which are automatically generated by the system default you have the account names and the job dates and times patient name references and addresses comments an option to complete the job on the very right and it also shows the status of the job as if the resources on its route or has arrived or is still pending and then you can also flag the job in case there is a problem with the job and can also make a return booking by clicking on this return arrow. You can also filter these by using the small indicators next to them. So yeah this is a very simple and convenient system which you guys can use. I will be explaining each and every function in detail in my next video so if you guys have any queries or questions you can always email it to me and my team and we'll be happy to answer all your questions. Please do not forget to subscribe and stay tuned. Thank you.